how to find the median and interquartile range from a cumulative frequency graph in 129 seconds. Let's go. Questions like this, which involve finding the median and interquartile range from a cumulative frequency graph come up all the time, guys. Let's have a look at this one and see how it's done. The question says, estimate the median and the interquartile range for the following, which shows the time taken by 15 students to complete the test. What are we going to do? Step number one, guys, that's going to be to identify which value, which of our 15 values actually represents our median. How are we going to do that? Well, what we're going to do is we're going to add one to our total frequency. Our total frequency of people, we know we have 15 students, so we're going to do 15 plus 1, which is going to give us 16, and then we're going to divide that by 2, 16 divided by 2, that's going to give us 8. So we know that our 8th value is going to be our median. So how are we going to find our 8th value? We're going to come over to our y-axis, which is our cumulative frequency, and we're going to read across over from our 8. We're going to draw a line over just like this. Make sure you use a ruler, guys, and then we're going to draw down from where that meets our line, and we can see that it meets the line at a time of 25, and that suggests, guys, that our median is going to be 25 minutes. Now, what about our interquartile range? That's going to be our upper quartile, subtract our lower quartile. How are we going to find which values represent the upper and lower quartiles? Well, we're going to do our 16, which we found by doing our 15 one times by one over four or divided by four. You could say that's going to give us our fourth value as our lower quartile. And we're going to times it by three over four or find three quarters of that 16. That's going to give us 12th value or our 12th value, I should say, as our upper quartile. So finding our fourth value, what's it going to be drawing across from our frequency of four? and down, we're going to have a time of 10 minutes. Doing the same with 12 then, drawing over from our frequency. Let me go back to my orange pen there, drawing across from a frequency of 12 and down to our time. And we can see that it's associated with 35 minutes. So we can do our upper quartile of 35, subtract our lower quartile of 10, 35 take 10 guys, that's going to give us 25. So we now have our interquartile range of 25 minutes.